This is Power News. I'm Susie. From Harmony Labs to Smart Intelligent World 2030, September was indeed a month of excitement. Power Utility Chairman Eric Shui recently wrote a forward for 6G The Next Horizon. He predicted that 6G would hit the market around 2030. He also noted that whether or not industry will provide a satisfactory answer to the definition of 6G by 2030 will largely depend on an open process and broad participation from a diverse range of players. 5G has deeply integrated into vertical industries more deeply and widely than any of its predecessors. This means that more industry partners need to take part in defining 6G together so it can meet more innovation requirements. Huawei is ready and willing to engage with our industry peers and with enterprises to envision and define 6G together. A single spark can start a huge blaze, and billion stars form a vast starry sky. In the three months since June 2nd, more than 120 million of users have updated their operating system to Harmony OS 2. By August, more than 1,700 hardware ecosystem vendors and more than 400 application and service partners had joined the construction of the Harmony OS ecosystem. There are over 1.3 million Harmony OS developers, a tenfold increase over last year. The major challenges facing the world today make the urgent need for digital transformation more than ever before. Last month, Huawei successfully held its annual flagship event, Huawei Connect 2021. In the opening keynote, Huawei Rotating Chairman Eric Shui shared Huawei's innovation progress and industry thoughts from four aspects – cloud services, AI, network, and low-carbon development. The world is paying special attention to reducing carbon emissions and tackling climate change this year. Many countries have set carbon-neutral goals. According to the data from WEF, ICT will help reduce carbon emissions by 12.1 billion tons by 2030, which is 10 times the emissions of the ICT industry itself. Eric Xu said, digital transformation is the key to going low carbon. Huawei has been aiming to combine digital technologies with power electronics technologies so that this can be used to manage work. The ultimate purpose of this is to dramatically cut energy consumption of ICT infrastructure. In specific, Huawei Digital Power Technologies was established this year. Its focal areas span from clean power generation, energy and transportation electrification to green ICT infrastructure and also integrated smart energy. Zhang Ping'an, CEO of Huawei Cloud and president of Huawei Consumer Cloud Service, also shared the progress of Huawei Cloud during Huawei Connect. Huawei Cloud has already brought together more than 2.3 million developers. Together with public clouds, it now serves 27 regions in more than 170 countries around the globe. In addition, Huawei released the Intelligent World 2030 report on September 22nd. The report described Huawei's prediction of the industry trends in eight directions, including healthcare, food, living space, and transportation. David Wong, executive director and president of ICT products and solutions of Huawei said, by 2030, the number of global connections will exceed 200 billion, and the average monthly data use on wireless cellular networks per person will increase by 40 times to 600 gigabytes, and the global general computing power will increase by 10 times and data generated will increase by 23 times, reaching one gigabyte for the first time. Digital infrastructure is the key to building this intelligent world. Huawei will be committed to innovation dedicated to breakthroughs to serve major application scenarios such as digital offices, smart manufacturing, wide area network, and data center, and also accelerate the development of the global digital infrastructure. And finally, in just a couple of days, on October 13 to 14, Huawei will host the Global Mobile Broadband Forum in Dubai. This year's MBBF will share 5G commercial success stories around the world and also explore future trends of the wireless industry and directions of 5G evolution. Please stay tuned.